you've been blessed with a wonderful gift from your Lord, your body. But the trouble about our nation today is that we're becoming chubbier and grumpier. We're not happy, we don't have a smile on our face, we always have a frown, and we're just getting bigger and bigger. Why? And a lot of people tell me, Doctor, I'm, I'm, I'm overweight, how can I take care of my body? Basically, if I take any calorie extra that my body requires, it goes to my warehouse, and you know where the warehouse is, okay? So, we have to really be aware that our body only needs certain amount of energy. We take more than that, it, our body is a good caretaker, it's, it's miser, it doesn't waste. It puts it into the storehouse, and the storehouse in the way of fat, and we're just getting fatter and fatter. That's one of the biggest problems in our country. One third of our children are obese. Our adults are becoming obese too. And it's a tremendous uh, burden on our health. In fact, obesity has been declared as a disease. So what can we do? It, diets don't work. Let's become just mindful. When you feel hungry, try and drink a glass of water. You'll be surprised. Most of us are thirsty. In fact, I want all of you now to watch your potty when you pee. If your urine is yellow, you are dehydrated. If you just watch that and keep your urine as clear as possible throughout the day, you will not be dehydrated and you'll probably eat less because most of the time we're feeling thirsty, but we think we are hungry and we eat food. So before every meal, have a big glass of water. Number two, start eating more veggies. We don't eat many veggies. We've become very, very processed food minded. You know, the vegetables that America consumes today is French fries and ketchup. So it's, it's a tragedy that we have so much. If you go to our grocery stores, it's, it's laden with fruits and veggies of all colors and all varieties. But we have become very selected and we only eat a few. So please become a wide forager of, a forager of all these foods because they were made for you by your creator for you. And yet we don't use them. So please have wide variety of fruits and vegetables. Your plate, half your plate should be full of veggies. The other half, made of meat, no more than a slice, not a deck of cards. And your, your, your carbohydrates, that's the proteins, and the carbohydrates, all whole grain stuff. Don't use polished rice, don't use polished wheat. You know, white wheat, white flour was really unnatural. It's, we have made it, but naturally it's all brown. <coughs> and another thing I think we don't do is laugh enough. We are too serious. And whenever you're upset, angry, nervous, we tend to eat more. So start laughing a lot. America doesn't laugh enough. That's why I was telling you, we've become grumpier. So find an opportunity to laugh. Don't take yourself so seriously and be forgiving. With this little few steps, you can really improve your destiny. Diets don't work, but always be mindful of how many calories you're taking. If you buy any book or you buy a phone app on, on, on your phone, you can see what calorie content of different foods. I'll give you a small example. If I eat one slice of bread extra, Every day, in a year, I'll have 15 pounds extra. That's how easy it is to gain weight. Unfortunately, some of us have a chubby gene. We get chubby faster. Others are blessed. They don't do it so well, so fast. But those who are, these were survivors. This was a good trait in the starvation days. But there's no more starvation. Our grocery stores are full of food. We're not starving. We are in the land of plenty and we're eating too much. And if we can cut down, take a smaller plate, put your fork down, Get up, the prophetic tradition is one third of your stomach should be full of water, one third air and only one third food. Do we do that? No, we overeat. So please, Thanksgiving is around the corner. Don't get up with your stomach so full of turkey. Take, take care of your body, be aware of what we eat and you'll see without dieting, you lose your weight and keep it down forever. God bless you.